We got LBG, how female rappers get signed. Nigga got some Luffy uh, uh, Easter eggs in the back. The next I some Spice, but she's trans. Oh, that's a Jeff Bezos check. Oh my God. L listen, do whatever it takes to get her into my office. You got a, just a random Modelo. One of these things is not like the other. How you got all these... Uh, these toys, these plushies, these, these, what are the Funko Pops? So you got all of these, you got the IM, and then the, the, the Freeze is second stage. Uh, is that second stage? Is that second stage Freeze? Well, technically, because first phrase Freeze is the one he's in, and then he transforms into that, and then the long head, and then final. So second stage Freeze, and then a Modelo? What, what kind of night was you having? My office. Suck her dick, for Christ's sake. I... Post out. Fully transition. We'll eat her man, pussy. Do whatever it oh takes, God. God damn it. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. No. Hey. Hey, no freaky. Hey boss, <laughs> I got an amazing artist for us, bro. I promise you. Nice. Does she have a BBL? No, there oh, it is. No, nah, no, nah, no. Nah. Huh. That's a prerequisite to be uh, to be a rapper. Is she from an urban area, preferably a jungle in the south? Jesus uh, Christ! But there are heights, I believe. Oh, there's enough coons there to be close enough. Uh, is she uh, light skin and attractive? Uh, not light skin and uh, solid six. Also, does their music have meaning? She is lyrically one of the best. She ain't getting nothing on TikTok. You lost her at not light skin. I ain't gonna lie, he brings up a good point. And you know it's the thing that annoys me with the whole female rap argument is everybody brings up Rhapsody as if she is the rule and not the exception to the rule. It's like, if we keep having these arguments or, or debates about representation in female hip hop, and, and that comes to all different styles of female hip hop, all different you know shades, of female rappers because it seemed like if they do the brown paper bag test if you don't know what that is google for uh, 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 uh female rappers nowadays um it's it's it and then people being up like, what about rap city and it's like rap city's dope shout out to rap city but that is not and she doesn't get mainstream attention either we're talking about and you're gonna be like well the mainstream is never gonna do that well that's the complaint that's the complaint. The thing that's pushed the most is is this. So, the best. It's true. He's not on lying. TikTok. So let me get this straight. No body modifications. She's not ghetto. She's not attractive or light skinned. I also hate when you niggas use ghetto as an adjective, as like as a describing word. I really hate that. That's just a ghetto. Ghetto's a place, bro. And black people weren't the first people in ghettos. So when you say ghetto, I don't know, there's just a lot. There's a lot behind that, that you're actually saying that I don't think you might understand. We got to stop putting the area where people live. And there's people who live in the ghetto and don't act like that. So don't, that's just such a weirdly, but black people, we we let people trick ourselves into hating ourselves all the time. Like that's what we do in America is we let people trick ourselves with these little micro things where you say things like where woke has become a, a term to just mean things that people don't enjoy in movies, particularly white people or ghetto just means if you're black and you act a certain way, that's cra That's like we need a different word, not because who else does that? That's cr that's crazy. That I, I just uh, div or I light skinned, and she's actually talented. What the fuck? That's everything that we're against in the music industry. What the fuck are you bringing me, man? Bro, just hear her out, man. I promise you, man. Mm -hmm. Send her in. Yes. I almost Send enjoy her. the term. I almost rather the term <laughs> ratchet than even ghetto. I even think that's a little coded but we can just say they they act crazy like it don't have to be okay you feel me? hey 
Because there's only a certain type of person that gets called ghetto <laughs> or ratchet, no matter how they act. It could be a white girl act the exact same. All of a sudden, they don't call her that. See me? Uh, so I heard you're a rapper of some sort. Yeah, yes. Um, I, I've been doing it for like a long time. A long time. Would you mind spitting something for us? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> check it, check it. Yo, I stop remember you right there. Um, there was no ignorance in that entire rap. Well, let her get it out. You ain't even. I didn't get to finish. What? What? what where is the pizzazz? The um, ah, uh, Barbie. Da 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 da. Like you thought I was finna. Ah! Like that's what makes us. Long Beach Griffey skits has have evolved on themselves. He does a lot of social. His skits are more social commentary. It's not just like, you know, like Caleb City and RDC World is more just like silly humor, right? RDC sometimes will will have social commentary about like blackness and stuff like that, which I I love RDC. Long Beach Griffey is damn near like political comedy. It, it is so it's like. And I like hey I like how he's 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 it's true. What he's saying is true. It is true. We cannot act like it's not true. Spinning you like like that's what makes us money. Yep. The bullshit. Yes, sir. I'm more of like a conscious rapper. Like And to me it's not necessarily just calling anybody who makes that kind of music like BS music because there's always room for that. My thing is mix it up a little bit. You know what I mean? Let's get some representations of other female experiences. You feel me? Um, I don't ever want to take away. Don't take away. This is what I say. Don't take away the sexy reds and the ice spices. Don't take them away. Let's just in. Let's add some more to balance it out. So everybody get a chance to. Oh, I want to listen to this kind of thing. Because some days I do want to. You know, after you listen to a whole bunch of, you might walk out the strip club. If I'm, in, yeah, I want to hear some music that make the geeks go like this. Facts, there's a time and place for all of it. I hate that people be like, real hip hop, erase it. No, there shouldn't be one type of hip hop, period. But there needs to be more representations of other kinds of hip hop. That's the problem. It's too oversaturated. Like, keep the sexy rags if you want to. Keep the ice spices. We don't need more of them, is the thing. Like a conscious rapper? Like, more for the community? Yeah, yeah, right? yeah. You're a fucking failure, I know. Oh my God. The industry doesn't give a fuck about moving your people forward. Uh-huh, talk. Holding your community back. That's where the bag comes. Yeah. Okay. How do we keep your people down and keep the label pockets on... Elon, boy, oh, have you Elon. niggas rap about gun violence? Keep you niggas in the Murder hospital rap. and dead. Have you bitches rapping about twerking? Keep you hoes in the club. Bad bitch, boss bitch mentality. Keep you hoes delusional, mentally unwell, and out of therapy. Before I turn you away and you only become relevant to hip hop elitists and bitches that light sage, let me show you when a real oh, woman he, he barred comes up. to the studio. He barred up. In the next video. In a, in a, in the very next video. It's, it's a it's a two-part. <laughs> that was smart. It's a two-part. It's a two-part. That was smart. Oh, hey, man. He ain't lying. <laughs>